Hi everyone, my name is David Casuto from San Francisco Computer Tutors and in this tutorial we're going to show you how to create an image map using Dreamweaver. Basically an image map is um, a certain area that you designate as clickable like let's say a map and you want to click on a certain state and you want that particular clickable item to go to another web page. So using our Story Street example here, I'm just going to basically make um, this tree circle a different link than the rest of these. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here on my properties panel. If your properties panel is not open yet, come over to Windows and choose properties. Okay, and I'm going to click on my image and you see over here it says map, right? And I've got three different shapes here. Okay, I'm going to move my mouse over it, it says I have my rectangular hotspot tool, I've got my oval hotspot tool, and I've got my polygon hotspot tool. This makes it nice and easy so I have my circle tool. So I'm just going to click on that and I'm going to draw a circle around the area that I, that I want to actually be my hotspot. So it says here, please describe the image map in the alt field on the properties inspector. This description will help visually impaired people who use tools that read web pages to them. So I'm just going to go ahead and put that in there. Okay, and I'm going to call this okay, story street home page. Okay. And then up here is where I put in my link, where the pound sign is. So um, my Story Street homepage, I'm just going to put in the whole thing here, just so you can see how it would look if you were going to do an external one. So storystreet.net. Okay, if it was going to be something that was already in your site route, it would just be, for example, index.html, or it would be um, contactus.html without the HTTP or www or anything like that. Okay, so now I can also move this around if I like to. Okay, and I can also reshape it if I want to, things like that. Okay, if I didn't like what I did the first time, okay, you can just go ahead and just drag it in, and now I've got my perfect circle there. And now I'm going to go ahead and test it, see if it worked. Come up preview in Safari, click on my globe there. I'm going to go ahead and save it. And now can see when I click on that it's going to take me right to Story Street. So it's as easy as that. See that? No link, no link, and then finally I go right over the circle. I've created what's called a hot spot. So think of some ways that you can do that. It's pretty easy but a really nifty trick. Well that concludes our exercise in Dreamweaver on creating image maps. Hope you enjoy that. Uh, once again my name is David Casuto from San Francisco Computer Tutors and uh, you can look me up on Yelp.com under San Francisco Computer Tutors and hope to hear from you soon. Thanks.